Hello everyone, this is the updated weather briefing for the series of storms we're expecting now through January 15th. So why are we concerned about California flooding? Well, we are expecting a series of atmospheric rivers to impact the same area of California between now and next week. This accumulation loop shows how much moisture is going to gather up so that by the January 15th, we could see 20 to 25 inches of precip over the Sierra, four to eight inches across the valley. That's a lot of precipitation with little breaks in between. So that's why we're expecting a lot of widespread flooding across portions of California. Please stay away from bodies of water and do not cross flooded road roads. It's one of the top reasons there are weather related fatalities. Now, look at the snow forecast. Saturday morning could be a little dangerous on I-5 going across Shasta County. Um, low snow levels down around 1,000 feet or lower. Um, and over the Sierra, snow levels around 3,000 feet with up to a foot of snow. On Monday, we could see snow again, but snow levels will be a little higher, around four to 5,000 feet. But again, another foot of snow is possible. Now let's take a look at the winds. Saturday morning could be pretty gusty south of Interstate um, 80, especially over the Sierra, which could cause whiteout conditions. Sunday, those gusty conditions spread across the valley, 30 to 45 miles per hour expected. Now with gusty winds, keep in mind that trees and power lines are more likely to fall down. So please stay away from any downed power lines um, and be prepared for extended power outages. Here is your mental checklist. Realize that today is really your last day for good storm prep. There is no definite window after today for when you can safely travel across the mountains. Have extra supplies. Don't forget to alert your family and friends about your storm plan and be ready to evacuate if it comes to that. Here are some great websites that you can use as resources for various topics related to this storm. And with that, we hope you continue to stay tuned with us. We appreciate you listening to our advice and please stay safe.